Hi, this is Brett uh, with uh, Let's Do This. This is, I'm using my son's GoPro, so I really can't really see what I'm shooting. But I just brought it home. It's a 1969 Apache Ramada. Uh, it's in, I think the only thing I got really going for me is that I got a good floor in it. Um, I had got it up earlier in the year and when we tried to put it down I couldn't get it up and I couldn't get it down uh, so back in February I think it was I bought this in December of 2015 and uh, it was February before I actually opened it up and then in March it started um, started raining and the river where i headed at on the arkansas river in arkansas uh it started flooding and uh they uh my wife's family pulled it up to another guy's house so it wouldn't uh wouldn't you know get stuck with water and uh they covered it but it, uh, the wind blew it up and it got some water damage as you can see right in here um I was going to throw the bedding away anyway. I didn't want 1969 bedding. Um, but all in all, it's really fixable, I think. I'm not going to have any cabinets in it. I'm doing this as a project for me. Uh, I do have a 22 cam uh, foot camper already at the river for my family and I, but this is when I go like for my horse racing and whatever. Um, there's a few spots on here and I think you'll see right here and there uh, on the ABS I've got I can, I can buy the letters uh, that need to be fixed and there's um, stuff on YouTube already that shows you how to fix it uh, it needs to be cleaned up really really well but I've got to get it up uh, because right now and I'll show you here in just a minute why uh, the door broke on me uh, as I was trying to bring it home um, so I had to drill out the rivets on the door and then set it in there <laughs> so it wouldn't fall out and tear up my door because that's one of a kind door I'd never be able to find another one uh, as you can tell it's I, I had to put new tires in it I bought this um, thing for 150 bucks really really and truly sight unseen even though i had seen it i hadn't you know we just went ahead for that price went ahead and bought it i thought well you know we can do something with it and uh when i got to research and stuff man this is a classic and uh of course some parts i can find some parts i'm just gonna have to make do with and uh i'll go back around on the other side and i'll show you why it won't come up and won't come down in case some of y'all have the problems with the lift system uh, the next video is what this will be I was just trying to show you this is going to be the start of a restoration and I intend on documenting every piece of it I just don't want to bore nobody but I need to get some information out there because uh, 1967 and 68 they had a slightly different lift system you know very simple 1969 if, if if i'm telling wrong please let me know but they had a chain driven drive and what what it is is if you can see this is the the ray socket and this back here is the bed socket well the bed slightly off of its chain and this chain's completely off of this sprocket for the slide but if you go back here on the back um, the, I found out this is called an actuator bar. This is where you crank it at. Uh, but I don't see any chain. I think this chain is broke right here. This pin has come out and the bed chain is on this sprocket. So that's right now, but it's off. Uh, I, I have to, it's done jump time. Anyway, as y'all see, this is the start of it. I've got so many plans for it, and it's going to take me a while. Um, I work two jobs, so I'm not going to be able to, to work on it every day. 
uh, I'll try to have videos well when I can that's you know I ask that you keep up with me uh, subscribe and like and uh, once I once I get up the first project's going to be to fix this door uh, well I'm sorry to the lift system and then the second project is is this door fixing it and uh, my color scheme is a burnt orange with white inlays um, and that I'm telling you I got some good videos coming uh, just bear with me uh, most of it like this front here it just needs to be cleaned up really really well now my locks I'm gonna have to find out how to take them off and redo them because three of them are rusted that one is not that's what it really should look like so uh, I'm going to put air in this one um, and that's a another project I've already figured out how I'm gonna do that um, I, I wish I could really show you I mean old cabinets they just falling apart I had pieces of wood flying out of it uh, coming down the road and I see that my doors fell that I did not want to happen because that's a one-of-a-kind door uh, anyway this is the start uh, if you would subscribe and like um, kind of helped me out I had no idea that this was the classic that it was till I went to research it so we'll do this together and as my motto is let's do this thank you